That chase coming down Penn Avenue earlier this morning and finally coming to a stop right against this building. You can see pieces of that SUV still left behind it between those bricks. Six teens inside that SUV, five of them taken to the hospital. Police still searching for one of them. The SUV smashed against this building at the corner of Penn Avenue and East Liberty Boulevard. The front crushed against the building. A door laying on the side of the street after the driver had to be cut out. Pittsburgh police say it all started at the border of Squirrel Hill North and Point Breeze just before 4.30 this morning. They did not have headlights on, so the officer tried to pull a U-turn to, um, and, you know, it stopped them mm -hmm. and informed them that they were driving without headlights. Instead, the uh, vehicle flew uh, down Penn Avenue at a very high rate of speed. That pursuit only lasting about 27 seconds before the 16-year-old driver crashed. Inside, six teenagers, all boys between the ages of 13 and 16. The 16-year-old driver in the most serious condition had to be cut out of the car. One got out of the car and fled away on foot. Uh, the five others are in local hospitals. One is critical. Right now, police are trying to figure out if the car was stolen. They said it did not belong to any of the passengers. This incident just the latest in a string of pursuits involving teens. Whatever those teens were doing, I'm pretty sure they were up to no good to the point where the police had to, like, Chase them. Police tape stretched across Penn Avenue for several hours while police reconstructed the scene. That investigation is ongoing. Reporting in East Liberty, Caitlin Sykes, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.